Hi everybody, welcome to the Astrology Report for November 23rd, 2022. This is going to be a longer video because we have a lot going on today. We start with the day with the moon in Scorpio, which is about your desires, which is about the occult, about the unseen, about the underworld or the unobvious parts of yourself. And this moon in Sagittarius has a trine meeting with Neptune that's saying, okay, what do you desire? And what are you going to do to make the things that you believe and that you want come into the physical? And then it also has an eliminator meeting with Mars saying, what are you willing to give up to achieve these goals? And these are actually really valid questions because at 117, the moon's going to go void. And then at 557 PM, going to move into Sagittarius and going to be in the new moon in Sagittarius, which is going to be exact at 5.57 p.m. And this new moon in Sagittarius has some beautiful aspects in it, right? It does have a beautiful trine with Jupiter that is saying, what do you want about your expansion? What are you going to do to expand? How are you going to bring your high mind ideas and philosophies and desires into the physical? It has a Venus in conjunct Venus and Mercury are going to be conjunct also in Sagittarius, which means there's this invitation and this ease to meet with other people around these goals, to speak these goals, to identify these goals, and to be progressive for these goals. Now, I usually don't talk about asteroids, but I need to here because in the mix are two asteroids that can cause chaos, that can cause loss. And this is the larger lesson of Jupiter, of when you are going for that expansion, you still have to find a balance between wanting more and being greedy with just wanting to get big, but not being mindful about how big you're going or what you're doing to get big. So I really mark this new moon as a new moon of ethics. What are the ethics of your life, of your operation, of what you're going to do and who you want to become so that you can be not only successful, right, but also divine, also godly, also on that higher octave of who you are and what you're meant to do in this world. And it's easy to want more, right? And it's easy to take shortcuts to get to more. But always remember, especially when Jupiter is in the mist, that those shortcuts, they do have costs eventually. So there is a wider lesson of being willing to take the long road of the harder road to get where you want to go. So definitely tap into this energy of going big and going wide and going for more, but make sure that that more includes your healing and includes your ethics. I love you guys so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.